Let's keep this short and direct. We'll review her performance and then we'll go our separate ways. Hi, you wanted to see me? Yes, thanks for coming in. Is everything okay? We wanted to talk about your termination. Gabby, don't use that word. We're not terminating you. Oh, thank God. <laughs> We're letting you go, as our friend. You do not have any ground to fire me as your friend. I've been nothing but loyal. Actually, we've been keeping track of your behavior since you abandoned us in that pool party in July. You have been monitoring my behavior without my consent? Do not play dumb. You know that all female friendship correspondence is subject to analyzing, unless you specifically state, don't tell anyone. Even then, the information is probably going to get leaked. Like how you told me not to tell Gabby that her new hair color made her look trashy. I told you that in drunk confidence. Best friend privilege. This is bullshit. Do you know how many people want to hang out with me? A lot. And I don't even want to be at your stupid cupcake parties. Well, that's interesting because you only attended one and you didn't even bring anything. Who doesn't bring anything to a party? I mean, I can't believe you're doing this right before my birthday, but... Your birthday party was the final straw. No one wants to cross state lines to see an adult survive another year. What? Come on, everybody loves Vegas. It's fun! Ah. Besides, this is a big one. No, it's not! 27 is not a big birthday! I don't like you enough to buy a plane ticket to see you. I could just see you in LA for free. I mean, three-day commitment? Fly out on Friday night? I just, I can't. You want me to check a bag? As you can see, the resentment is growing. I don't want to see any more stupid pictures of your little dog. Looks like a rat. All right, so this is it. I've been listening to you two bitch about each other for nothing. Not for nothing. Uh, we'll provide you with good references and we'll remain friends on social media. If anyone asks, we'll just say that we lost touch. Fine. I don't need you to. Oh, by the way, I'll be taking Stacy and Rachel with me. Hmm. You have a non-compete and we already agreed to house sit for them. Something they would never trust you to do. You're gonna crash and burn without me. <sighs> Who's next? Your brother. It was smart for us to rent this room. A coffee shop would have been a little impersonal. How long do we have it for? I think 2.30, so we should be able to get my aunt in. Great. She's a bitch. <laughs>